Hey buddies, Potato McWhiskey here and welcome back to Let's Play Steel Division Normandy 44 and we're on mission 4 of the Mission Boston campaign. We're going to be doing Iron Fist. Let's read the mission order here. Major Warren Panzer Ersatz Abteilung 100 has been located near the village of Bout Bout. I don't know how to say that. Uh, it, appear, it seems it's all tanks are slowing its retreat. Which gives us an opportunity to trap it between your battalion elements from the 101st Airborne coming this way. Uh, your orders are to link with the 506th from the 101st Airborne, thus trapping as many German troops as possible between you. As a secondary objective, try to get in contact with the old local with the local resistance. They seem to be a bit over eager to get to grips with the retreating occupier and could be some help if you are able to challenge channel their zeal. All right, let's get going. We're going to meet meeting up with some French resistance to the uh, German occupation. Looks like are they some Panzer IVs on the screen there in the loading screen? Very cool. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, uh, I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit sad that this is the last mission. Actually, um, I was kind of hoping for more. Being brought ashore almost daily, we're finally breaking through the German defenses. Although the 101st is still heavily engaged in Carenton against the German paratroopers, the Fourth Infantry Division is opening the way to Cherbourg to the north, while the 90th is leading the charge west to cut the Cotentin in two. As for us, we've been given the opportunity to settle some scores with our old friends from Panzer Ob Tylung 100. We are about to link with elements from the 101st Airborne coming from the southeast, trapping any German units still lingering north of us, amongst which the French resistance has identified Panzer Abteilung 100 retreating towards the village of Bolt and attempted to harass it on its way. The ambush appeared to have worked well at first until the local FFI partisans encountered Fallschirmjäger forming the rear guard of the German column. The FFI have been pushed back into the woods, surrounded. Our orders are to link with the 101st and seal the pocket, destroying Panzer Abteilung 100 in the process and if we can, to give the partisans some assistance. Yet beware of those Fallschirmjäger. They are no ordinary soldiers. And intel can't tell us much about their strength. Okay, so I need to be careful about the Fallschirmjägers. Uh, you must gain a conquest mode victory. Allies 3000, okay. Needs us. Compose your battle group. So I have an ally here. And I'm going to be playing from this end. And it looks like there's some partisan over here. It looks like they're just regular riflemen, but it might be worth it to link up with those. Um, looks like we're going to be very he infantry heavy to push through here to get through this forest. A very, very wide map, which makes me really worried. So let's uh, compose our battle group. We are Task Force Warren. Uh, recon was, I think we're going to go with the standard sort of Pathfinder recon and the M20... Uh, Sort of stuff that we've been doing pretty much every game. Uh, we do have 35 unit cards now. In terms of anti-air, it might be... I think we will just go light on anti-air. We'll take these. Um, we will use these M15 GCMGs. Uh, G CGMC, because they uh, are pretty good. And plus, we don't want to use up these cards here. I will be bringing a lot of air here. Um... Preferably, I would like to bring some heavy bombers because I've been a bit light on bombers. Now, I could spend 50 extra points and get a slightly bigger uh, explosion radius. Um, but I think, I think I'll stick with the Marauders in Phase C. In Phase B, I do want a couple of Bombardiers. And uh, we might bring the grasshopper as well, just for the uh, for the for reasons. Uh, I will want to bring some mortars. I think I'll bring six mortars. I did find a lot of use for them, so I like having extras. These are power. These are airborne units. Oh, I could bring some eighty. I think I think I'll instead of bringing two sets of mortars, I'll bring the eighty-one millimeters, and then I'll bring some phase B howitzers. Um, those were actually pretty useful. I think I'll, I'll go fairly light on the artillery. The mortars should do the trick for the most part. I'm going to want a lot of anti-tank. Till phase C, okay. 
Um, I think what I'll do here is I'll take the sort of general, I'll take some light anti-tank guns in the early game, take some medium anti-tank guns in the late, in the mid game, and then I'll take a lot of tank destroyers in the late game, and I'll bring some bazookas. Well, I don't think I need bazookas. So I might just bring some extra. Uh, no, I think I'll, I think this should be just fine. This should be just fine. Now in terms of support, uh, I do like these M7 DDs. I will bring the 50 cal jeeps because they're quite useful. I will bring the M20 command. I will bring the four opal blitz because they're just useful to have. And I might bring the M8 Scots, even though they didn't get much use last time. Well, I could bring the M7 DD, which is really good for taking out infantry. There's a lot of forests here, so I might bring the M8 Scot instead. Um, now, in terms of tanks, I will bring some DDs. I will want to take some M4A3s in the late game. It's definitely something I want to do, so I'll grab some of those. Uh, in terms of, I could get an M4A3 in phase B, but I think I'll, I'll think I'll save them for the phase three. I haven't really had too much trouble dealing with armor, although this is going to be a mission with a little bit more armor. I will take some more DDs because these are kind of like a little bit better tanks. Um, and then I might bring some M4A1s. Oh, what's the difference between these? Same gun. These are actually just better, so I might just bring these. Bring a bring a couple of DDs in the other game, so I have a little bit of a tank option. Then transition over to M4s in the um, mid game, and then M4A3s in the late game. Okay, infantry wise, I'm gonna want a lot of infantry. I'm gonna want the AB leader. I'm going to want the MMGs. I'm gonna want the uh, AB rifles. A couple of AB rifles, I think. Uh, I'm going to want to pick up some glider rifles here in the late game with uh, HMGs and some glider leaders. And I think we might even pick up some AB engineers here because there is going to be a lot of forest fighting. And the AB engineers should be able to do some good work in the forest. Hopefully um, we'll see how that manages to work out for us. Okay, so we have three more cards here to use up. Um, I think I might get some extra pathfinders because there's a lot of forest stuff going on here. And I would also maybe like to get some more, uh, maybe get some, maybe get the M7DD, bring it in. No, it's, I might bring in, I might just grab some Jeep supplies because they're a little bit quicker, if I recall correctly. They're 100 kilometers per hour, whereas the Opal Blitz is 88. So it's a little bit quicker. Um, and then I've got one more card here to use up. I have a lot of tanks in at my disposal. I think I could pick up a little bit of extra artillery here. I could bring up some more 105 howitzers. Um, and that should do the trick. We've got good mortars here in the early and mid game. And I think that'll do the trick for me. So, uh, eight minutes here to set ourselves up. Well, that's good. All right, so I have 750 points, which is quite a bit. Um, so let's have a little bit of a think. We're going to want a lot of infantry to fight over here. Um... We have to pretty much fight at every point here on this map, which is a really difficult thing to do um, to manage such a wide front line, especially because we're going to be up against basically two um, enemy divisions. We're up against the Armored armored over here and the Fallschirmjäger over here. We are going to want to split them off in half if we can manage that. Um, so I will want to be putting like my heaviest attack down center. So let's in get some... We've got an AB leader. We'll take... Two AB rifles. Uh, we'll bring. Uh, will will MMGs be very useful here? I don't think an MMG will be very useful here. So we might just go for three rifles. With a mortar support, and uh, a couple of pathfinders, and then that'll be like my center. That'll be center flank. I'm going to be using recon over here because uh, recon aren't needed to fight. So I will be... I want one recon over here. I want maybe like two recon here. Uh, this particular recon is going to get to this point in the map and unload. This recon is going to get over here and unload. Recon is going to get over here and unload. And that should provide a pretty good coverage of recon here in general. 
for us to work with. I'll give you exact orders over here. Now, Pathfinders are definitely going to want to fight over here in this forest. Um, we're going to want to play defensively if we get a machine gun positioned over here. Yeah. So we will get uh, probably two Pathfinders over here. We'll bring uh, a couple of these MMGs. We'll bring an Engineer. We'll bring a Rifle and an AB Leader. And that should be enough to cover this flank here. Now, down center here, we're going to want to bring one tank. And we're going to want to bring an extra recon for this guy as well. And we're going to want to bring a couple jeeps to form some a, a very lightly armored attack force over here. Not going to be bringing much over on this flank. Well, I could actually get rid of these jeeps and instead bring a little bit of... Um, I think I'll bring a grasshopper instead. Okay, let's make sure we have all of our orders given out. Yes, sir. So you're going to quick move over there. It's a good okay, position. Sir. You're going to quick move over there. I'm going as fast as I can. Okay. Yes, sir. So I have a lot of these units are doing their trick. And these, these guys, they come with little jeeps that I'll be able to use to fight um, infantry and stuff like that. Now, as far as these guys are concerned, I'm pretty much going to fast move up to this area. Uh, I, I, hopefully this will work out now for me. I want to do like a save if I can, um, just in case I get screwed. But we're pretty much going to want to fast move over here and unload and get into this forest as soon as quickly, as soon as possible, and then start clearing it. We're going to want to take a pathfinder, a rifleman, and a leader over to this forest and unload, and then we're going to want to take the other three over to this forest. And unload yes. and that should provide in theory a good front line to hold so let's give this a try in the meantime we will fly out a grasshopper okay so we have a little scout plane to help us out I want to stay zoomed out here so that I can have a good overview of the battle to see what sort of outbreaks happen Okay, I think I might need you to get out of here. Okay, there's a storch over here. Get up into this forest. Get up into this forest. Get up into this forest. And we'll take these two and go over here. Uh, why don't you come over here? Looks like we've got a rosy. What's that? That's a storch. Uh, you can unload now. Bring this jeep out into the open. Bring this scout up. Bring this jeep back here a little bit. Come up over here, hide there. Looks like there's a lot of armor over here, so we are definitely going to bring up some anti-tank weapons here. Grasshopper under attack. You get out of there. Take care. This you can evacuate now. Alright, nice. We got a kill already. got some bounces we're gonna to want to bring in another anti-tank gun if we can we got two kills now fall back if you can went to defensive mode push up here push up unload I need you to get that kill not quite Um, this is kind of scary actually, so I'm going to save up for a Mustang maybe if I can get it. 
That's really bad. I need another tank here. Okay, I can't focus on that too much. I do have other front lines to worry about. Push up over here. Attack move forward here until you're in range. Okay, they're falling back. That's good. Push up here a little bit with these guys. Gather some more map control. We've always linked up with the partisans. What's your chance of breaking? You've got a good chance of hitting, but not a very good chance of penetration. All right, we're going to bring up another tank here to hold this front line. See if I can get you guys to... Do some good work. Hey, where's my mortar? I need to bring my mortar up. That's a mistake. I should have a mortar here. Uh, I'm going to want to bring up a mortar here as well. Can you cross this? Can you cross over here? What are these? It's like little mo motorcycle recon. Oh, that's bad. You tack move over here. Uh, I want to bring up a uh, jeep here. Provide fire. Okay, we've almost linked up with the French. We've, I would say we have pretty decent map control here. My grasshopper is ready. I'm going to bring my grasshopper in. Okay, nice. We killed that guy. Need to fall back here. Get up into this forest. Get up to here. There is a tank over here that I need to deal with. Okay, we should have now the ability to provide support. Let's see if we can't bring up another couple of rifles. One, two. And we'll bring up an AB leader with some engineers and a... That'll be it. We've got all of our anti-tank guns on the field right now. See if we can't get you to attack move up here with this tank. We've lost contact with several patrols on our right flank, Major. Something smells fishy here. I'm going to attack move up here. You need to go deal with this. Uh, let's get the Mustang here to stress this tank out. Whoa, take these guys out. Okay, we got that tank to retreat. Can you chase him down? Make him retreat. Keep him stressed out. Can you cross and link up with them? At your order. Okay, it's safe for you to move across now. We're operational. Get these guys unloaded and moving up into the forest over here. Need a light, sir. Pathfinders can cross. We can get these machine gunners over to this position now. We We've got mortars up on the front. Move up. If you can't get up there, I need you to move fast over there, actually, if you can. Got Rosie doing good work. Pathfinders, see if we get the Pathfinders here. We need to link up with these guys. Um, see if we can cross into this forest here. Uh, can you capture him? Make him surrender. Ten four, good buddy. Great. 
All right, we made him surrender. It's exactly what we were hoping for. Move you forward a little. Bring this tank up. Uh, we're going to attack move these guys so they don't get caught out. No, they're not. Need to fall back if you can. Uh, you start hitting those guys. Attack move across here. Okay, things are going just fine. If you can get over here. We're going to want some AB rifles up in this position here. We have them super pinned back now. I think they're going pretty good at this point, I think. If you guys can get up a little bit closer. Looks like there's an IG. I want to take that out if I can. Uh, get another Mustang here to bomb it. See if you guys can link up with these Pathfinders over here. Get these AB rifles in position. Need to follow along with these guys. Bring these mortars up a little bit. The besieged partisans are safe now. They're offering their services to fight the Germans. They are out of supplies. I will need to bring up a. Partisan friends have contacted some of their comrades who have captured the workshop from Panzer of Tula 100 near Bust. They've salvaged some old French tanks and are bringing them to the fight. Bringing up some French tanks, eh? Oh hell yeah! Damn, that's nice. Alright, so what kind of tanks are these? This is the Char 1. And then these are... H something else's. You drop a little bit of mortar fire here. Can you cross? Okay, we have a supply jeep coming up here. See if we can get all of these... Whoa, what's that? See if we can drop a bomb on these guys. Progression is going well, Major. We're on schedule. Sir? German reinforcements are on our right flank, sir. Panzer Grenadiers with armored support. According to our scouts, they're from 17 SS. How the hell could Intel have screwed up like this? Hmm, looks like there's a big push here. Can you can you fast move over here? See if you can get uh, over there. We'll get these riflemen. These riflemen aren't too great, actually, so I'm going to try and just keep them safe and have them as uh, front line holders. Oh, goodness. This is really scary. Uh, let's see if I can unload you. We're holding a lot of the map right now. We need to take control of this section over here. Got a pretty big armored column here. It's really good for us. We can move some of this stuff up here a little. Some really good vision over here actually. So let's get a get a thunderbolt. Do an attack run. Let's see if we can get a hit. Should do some serious damage if we can get a hit on this. And then you can evac, just get out of there. See if I can get you up onto the road. Uh, let's get a couple of engineers here with... I would like a glider leader, but I'll just get the HMG up here. Looks like... Oh, very nice. We've got some French resistance coming up, I think. Yep. Yeah, that's really good. Fall back, fall back. Fall back. Um, see if you can move up here. Ooh. Uh, where's my leader unit? Savage those guys. Uh, is 
That's a really, that's a Stug 4, that's really scary. See if you guys can move up here. Oh goodness. Uh, where's my air? I need a lot more units up here. Let's get some... Get all our glider rifles up into this fight uh, with a glider leader. We did some bombing. See if we can take some positions here. Uh, what am I losing? I lost a recon over here. That's scary. You need to fall back. That's bad. Need to bring in some of these tanks. Uh, do we still have control of most of the map? We still have control of more of the map, but not most. Um, I need air support and I need tanks and I need everything. I've got a lot of units coming up here, which is really good. See if I can start hammering these guys. That's bad. I was hoping this would be a kill. Alright, this should be a kill. You guys should be able to get that kill. Get these riflemen up into this forest. Where's my glider leader? Alright, he's coming up. We got some shit to surrender over here, that's good. Oh, you need to fall back. Oh, I need to get my thunderbolt on this guy. Let's get out of here. Um, air, don't quite have enough to deal with this stuff over here. That's really scary. Can I bring up an anti-tank gun? It's only 11 AP. We'll have to bring it up. It's our best chance. Okay, things are going just fine over here. Oh, they're not so fun. Uh, let's get some of these. And uh, we'll get a glider leader over here too. A lot of French units come up here on the left to help us in the forest, which is good. So I'm going to I'm gonna start focusing here on this stuff. We've got to stay behind these forests. All right, let's get this Thunderbolt. It's looking the wrong way, so we sh if this hits now, we'll get a kill. But it's looking the wrong way, it's not ready for this attack. Didn't manage to get it. Get up into this forest. Get over there, I don't want your card open. Okay, we're getting some surrenders happening on the enemy side of things. If you can zip up here and give them the old what for with your rifle. Whoa, what are you doing? Oh, you need to get out of there. Oh, I admit that I tried to throw smoke, but I wasn't quick enough. 
All right, I'm almost out of infantry, so this forest fighting is going to get really t tough here in a second. So let's, we're setting up an ambush here. Uh, I need more tanks. Ready to kill that. Oh, now you need to get back. Need to bring up another anti-tank gun if I can. Very nice. Hope you're ready for this. Nice one. Keep strafing this infantry. Oh, they've got a bomb going on over here. That's really tough to deal with. Um, it was over here, wasn't it? Alright, so I need to bring up... Well, Howard's is over here to deal with that. I had a bunch of infantry over here. It looks like it's all dead. We still have more than half of the map, though, so we're going to be just fine. The main thing in here is to stop the bleeding. Oh, that's bad. If you can guys start hitting these things. Uh, where's my grasshopper? The grasshopper's out here scouting. It's really good. We lost a gun. That's really bad. That's all of my anti-tank guns, actually. Luckily, though, we have the M4A1 destroyer. Available to us now. Or the M1, uh, the M10A1. I'm gonna want to bring up here just to get some token infantry over here, just to stop this happening. Um, it's not good. Can I do a little bit of a push on this side? Just to see if I can snake just a little bit of territory away from them. Uh, we've got to do a thousand more points, and we're getting one point per second. That's really good that we're getting these hits on these guys. Um, kind of wish I had a little bit more RT, but I don't can't quite afford it. I need to move you guys over here to prevent you getting um, hit. All right, I have a I have a Wolverine now. Essentially, I think well, I don't know if they're called Wolverines, but that's what I remember them being. Uh, can you hit a little bit with these mortars? I think I'll bring up some. I think I need to bring up a couple. I think I need to use my mortars better, but I'm going to bring up another ID piece over here so we can start counter batterying this thing. Um, oh, he's hitting my uh, thing. Actually, speaking of which, I might bring in my own anti air. So you guys need to get over here. I need to bring up some recon. Um, and I'm going to bring up Pathfinders because they're the closest thing to um, fighting infantry that I have. Uh, you need to fall back. You did your job. Admittedly, you did a good job. Uh, how are you getting hit? What's finding you? Let me see if you guys can move over there and play it safe. See if we can drop a bomb on this stug. Hit the stug. He should be ready to panic. 27% chance of penetration, 20% chance of hitting. Not quite good enough. Um, where's my recon? Get these pathfinders up into uh, into good positions. We get these already. I want to hit these 
these guys would already from different positions. Um, well, what are you shooting at? Oh, you're shooting at these guys. If I get my Thunderbolt to do a hit, maybe you can retreat. Managed to make them panic at least. Uh, we'll drop some bombs on these infantry over here. You guys can fall back a little bit. I need you to retreat because you're my main anti anti ground. I'm gonna bring in a marauder here. I just need to keep pushing these guys back with bombing runs because they don't have very good AA right now. that's my best option for okay so I got some infantry over here which is gonna help stop the bleed to you need to do some smashing over here to try and slow those guys down uh, we still just barely have more than half of the map just barely uh, we're gonna bring in another air unit here and see if we can continue to smash the enemy you guys can retreat now my heavy bombers are gonna like have them retreat but I'm gonna bring in my my grasshopper now as well lots of air air, air power is really powerful in this game All right, we're also gonna smash them with some artillery to get them into a full retreat uh, hit over here hit over here And actually even in bring in another artillery and we'll bring in a supply truck next income wave this is really bad over here we lost an AB mortar over here that's fine it was kind of expected that we would lose some of this stuff over here um, I wasn't expecting this huge uh, false maker push that kind of got me off off guard Okay, uh, we're going to bring in here a supply truck for these guys. Going to unload you. I feel comfortable moving you guys up to here. And then I will follow up with a um, tank destroyer. Oh, there's their artillery over there. Can you guys all hit them? Not quite. You need to get into position. Um, can the tank destroy? The tank destroy does have HE shells, but not many, which means we are going to want another Opal Blitz here to supply these tanks at the front. Okay, we're going to want some extra recon now. Even more. Because um, our, our vision over here isn't very good without the uh without the grasshopper where is my grasshopper uh, yeah you're doing good doing good work over here keeping keeping me with uh, supplied vision i have a mustang here uh i should be able to panic these thugs we lost my half track over here got 500 points to go 13 minutes looks like we might be able to squeeze through this mission without any real issues I liked this whole conquest mission. It was a really cool idea of a mission, you know. Um, sadly, my my ally has lost a bit of territory over here. He could easily hold this with a couple of um, a couple of infantry, probably. But I'm running low on stuff too. I'm, it was really cool that this guy took over this front because this was a lot of front to manage. Um, linking up with the French was definitely the right choice here. Uh, can you strafe those things? You guys in position yet? You are in position. I will get. Two of you to hit here. And I will get two of you to hit over here at will. Moving the guns up here. Okay, I need to bring in my next scout plane because I've run out of vision. I've got another P-51 Mustang and I want to get it to blow up over here. Where exactly is this being fired? Here. That's where I need you to bomb. 
to panic them and get them to stop uh stop throwing their goddamn shells at me I lost a tank over here, that's not great. Get my Thunderbolt. He'll work on panicking. See if I can fast move you along here. Thunderbolt should have panicked them pretty well. Alright. Got my Thunderbolt as well now. Nice. Do a little bit of strafing. All right. Uh, looks like this is being lost. I'm gonna bring in my glider leader and a machine gun. That's all I've really got available left in the recon on the infantry front. Um, I may as well bring in an M4A3 to try and hold whatever's going on over here. Uh, I will get a marauder to deal with this and with this because. Well, this guy actually, I'm going to get him to hit this artillery piece because I'll panic a, um, a flak as well. And this should kill this artillery. Very nice. Those are two really nice hits. Uh, get those guys to retreat ASAP. You push up with these guys. I have some machine gunners I can push across this forest, this field with. I can push forward with these guys a little bit. Mm, looks like I'm getting hit by something. I got hit by something over here. I'm not sure how they have vision of where my stuff is because I haven't fired with them in a little bit. But, you know, probably the AI cheating or something. Uh, I'm going to unload here. And I'll bring up a couple more of these. M4s, A1s to try and hold this forest. Uh, I could probably get away with bringing an M20 command over here too. I didn't really focus on this flank. This was like where most of my fighting was centered around right here. I want to try and cut these guys in half. Didn't quite manage it, but I think overall we've done really well. They can't get through easily. You guys push forward a little, push forward a little bit. You have no HE left, so I'm going to pull up on Opal Blitz. We're about to win. We're very close to winning, which is really good. Um, I, I, I'm quite proud of how this mission has gone. I say proud, but... See if we can't push along here, and we'll get these guys to push this forest also. Um, where's my Grasshopper? See if you can come in here, Grasshopper. Give me a little bit of vision. Yeah, we got a few more minutes here until we... Uh, we complete our mission. Oh, it looks like there is a pocket formed over here. Got my, uh... Yes, sir. You hit this guy, see if you can't hit this guy. Should hit this guy too. Um, if you can hit it over here. Oh, they've got artillery observers. I need you to fast move to here. And then attack move here last move to here attack move to here can you push up this road here oh wait no i need you to stop because you're actually out of um you're actually out of the things that you use to shoot bullets that's what you're out of you're out of bullets pushing these guys back with a little bit of art arty fire push this guy forward push you up bring him forward a little bit uh yeah i think we're doing pretty good Awesome, we did it. Germans trapped in the pocket are coming to our outpost in their hundreds to surrender, Major. We bagged them. Awesome. Oh, a movie. Link up with the 101st Airborne is made, and armored forces are pouring in from the beaches. Secured. Time to go on the offensive. Next stop, Cherbourg.
Hey, we did it! Congratulations, us! Alright, nice. That was a lot of fun. I liked that mission. That was a cool, interesting mission. Um, overall, a very cool game. I like I like Steel Division a lot, um, so far from what I've played for it. I, my only real complaint is that the developer has heavily em emphasized multiplayer. Um, and I'm, I'm, I've no problem with that. I just don't really like playing real-time strategy games in multiplayer. You know, it, it's, it's fine. But, uh... Yeah, uh, I, I think it was a, it was certainly an interesting mission. A lot, a lot happened. A lot of stuff was dying, even right up until the end. Um, some of my guns, like this, this gun, Hero of the Beginning, really saved my ass that I managed to pull that gun in uh, to kill all those Panzers and the BMW uh, Scout motorcycles. But we had a lot of like really good units. But we also, we also had a couple of units that the enemy just like annihilated with. There was like some pioneers to get on here and just killed like all of our glider rifles. So they had some pretty good units. I don't think anything comparable to what we managed to pull off with some of our units. But I think um, overall, I was really satisfied with this game. It was really fun. I'm really enjoying it. And you know, that was we got. We, I've gotten like, what was it? I think it was thirty to forty minutes a mission. Let's let's call it forty minutes a mission, right? Um, four missions. So that's an hour and twenty minutes. That's two hours and forty minutes. Nearly three hours per per campaign. Uh, so the three hours out of the first campaign. That's a pretty good deal. Uh, so this one was medium difficulty. This one's going to be hard difficulty. And this one's going to be very, very hard. Uh, we will see if we'll be able to pull this off. So I want to thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys are enjoying this series. Please remember, if you want to see more of me playing Steel Division uh, Normandy 44 or indeed any other game that I play, make sure you subscribe to my channel to get notified when new videos come out. If you want to directly support my channel and increase my personal success on YouTube, increase the performance of the channel, make sure you leave a like on the video. Other than that, you can leave a comment to give me your feedback and all that other good stuff. I'll I do my best to answer every comment I get. Other than that, I want to thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying this series. I love you all very, very much, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.